All right, today we're going to build a Volkswagen golf cart. What? Rob, this isn't a Volkswagen. It, the engine's in the rear. Still not a Volkswagen. It's small, tiny, tiny, cute little car. It's, it's still not a Volkswagen. Well, there's a Volkswagen connection. What's that? See, actually, this car here, the smart car, was uh, designed by the guy who created Swatch Watch. A little strange, I know. <laughs> but in the early days of the, the, the design, Volkswagen was you know involved with all of that. Later on down the road, uh, they saw some trouble with CEOs and whatnot. So they went over to uh, Mercedes-Benz. So it's actually Mercedes, but. Close enough. It's close enough. Looks like a Mercedes. So <laughs> anyway, so you've seen us at the car shows. We're running around the golf cart and we got all the camera gear and stuff. It's just a little difficult to get stuff in and out. And you know, we don't want any sticky fingers grabbing some gear. So went to the smart car. It's got it. Air conditioning. Got AC. <laughs> yes. <laughs> so we're going to lift it two inches and put. Lift it? <laughs> yes. what yes <laughs> oh, i didn't tell you that sounds terrific i guess we're gonna we're gonna lift it to go in the wrong way <laughs> yeah well we're gonna lift it two inches put big tires on it and uh maybe we should go golfing <laughs> sounds like fun let's get after it <laughs> so we're running the fans today we got here at four in the morning as you can see through the door the doors open it's never open here but it's hot so it's hot. sorry about the audio that's what we did. Deal with it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's right. So we, uh, fortunately, there's a lift kit for this. So we don't have to fab everything up. And it came with instructions. <laughs> and my dog ate them. <laughs> so that's what we got to do with these. So we started off. We're just going to wing it. I've done plenty of lift kits. So uh, we basically got our struts unbolted up top. Hopefully that's the first step. I know they probably should do the brake lines and whatnot, but I think we can get away without doing that. But well, basically what we're gonna do is just drop this whole cross member down and uh, lower the whole suspension. So we got some spacers. There's a, an extension for the steering. And there's some spacers up top for the struts and I think a strut extension. Hopefully we can figure it out on our own. Roll the montage. <laughs> <laughs> so we got the steering extension and we believe it goes on the steering. It should go out there somewhere. <laughs> Get that up there. Take these bolts out and drop okay. this down farther. Back to the lower brake line's not looking good there. Is that already packing? Yeah, oh, yeah it's so good. So we have to tie this up and be fine. All right. All right, everything's completely loose. We're just kind of floating here. This is a little, little sketchy. Now, the directions for this part said, well, I don't know what they said. <laughs> <laughs> so, remove and then <laughs> ask your dog. <laughs> I better go check the yard. Maybe I can find the rest of the directions. Hold on, let me. We're going pretty good. Cue here. the circus music. <laughs> so we got these little spacers, and they uh, are going to go right up in here and drop down this hole. Kind of a cross member deal. Follow me, cameraman. <laughs> <laughs> well. All right, so that's truly really this whole piece ass. here has the steering, the A arms, the, everything is attached besides the upper strut mount. So all of the suspension is just hanging there. Just Pretty like so a golf cart. Four bolts. <laughs> It's crazy. <laughs> it really is. Okay, gotcha. 
All right, so let's. I'm wondering. Not, it's not lining up too easy. Maybe if, maybe if I put down the camera and help. <laughs> it's like I want it. Maybe I was wrong. It's happened. No. So you, no just, you're not recording, are you? Yeah. <laughs> Robin's never been wrong. Nope. <laughs> All right, this one's gonna make me angry. You wouldn't like Rob when he's angry. No. Turn all green. <laughs> he gets even uglier. <laughs> After all this COVID, I feel like I've gained as much weight as the Hulk does when it turns, you know. I gained those COVID Hulk pounds. I don't know what to do. <laughs> Stop filming me. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Trying to get it to go down on this the rack or the. Where am I? You're on the rack. I don't know oh, if I'm oh. in the right spot. Maybe I'm not. It, it's got to go down some. Oh, okay. you got to take the bolt out. It's got a divot. So am I in the right divot? You're not all the way down because the bolt was hitting. I think. Oh no, it's. That's bottomed out. Oh, I see. Yeah, it's a slot. Oh, it's a big slot. See, yeah, it's a big old slot back there. So right. that, that's bottomed out. That's where it goes. And then that has to go in there. It's a little tight fit. I might need a hammer to tap that one in. Hammer time! Ah, oh, yeah. Where's my nut? 15. That looks like 14. Looks pretty good. You're on. Now you need that other bolt, right? The factory bolt. Got it, Rob. <laughs> look at that shit. I mean, look at that stuff. <laughs> can you hold that side? Yep. I sure can. All right. Since I really want to get a good shot here, I'm gonna. I'll do the camera work. <laughs> And Ryan can tighten it. <laughs> now, per the directions, it's well, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> Ask your dog. <laughs> you okay, little buddy? You okay, little buddy? Yeah. I know Ryan's a bad, bad man. <laughs> <laughs> Careful now! Ow! <laughs> All right. Get the bottom one tight. You sabotage me. All right. So the key here is to be done before the sun comes up, because because that's Florida. That's when it gets hot. <laughs> oh. Er. If you're just tuning in, the fan is on because it's hot. Hopefully you're not tuning in in the middle of a build here, though. But yeah. Whatever. You know, going back to my TV roots. <laughs> After the break, <laughs> watch Ryan eat his tuna fish sandwich. All right. Let's crank those bad boys down. Now, hopefully in the directions, it doesn't say, man, the light is bright. Oh. <laughs> hopefully in the directions, it doesn't say, do not put the steering extension in until after Right. <laughs> you should have brought your dog. All we gotta do now, put a little spacers up on. There we are, we're back. All right, so all we gotta do now is put our little spacers up on top of our struts with some extensions, bolt them in. Front's done. Monster truck time. I'm going to give you a quick walk around and let you know why we haven't done as many how-to projects lately. It's because Ryan's shop is a little full. As you can see, every square inch is covered. 
And that right there is the table we normally would work on, but there's no room. So take a second and subscribe. Help Ryan get these things out of here so we can get back to work. All right, so we're to the point of this. No, we're not to that. We're going to, to this. Ah, yes. So, Slide the spacer over the stud extension and line it up with the factory rubber isolator on the bottom. Sounds simple enough. You're right. You're right. I didn't really say I was wrong. I'm just saying <laughs> you were correct. Okay, gotcha. <laughs> All right, so, but right, this is the important step right here. Right there, yeah. I'm yeah, so let's make sure we cover that one. <laughs> is that in there? Mm -hmm. We're doing it. Yeah, All right. It's in there. Follow me, cameraman. <laughs> Little extension. That's French for extension. I I understand. Oh, I speak fluent French. <laughs> Just the bad words. <laughs> okay. Just gotta tighten that down. That's easy enough. Yeah, those cut it. Those are some sorry snips. Is it they gonna reach? It's a good thing there's plastic panels. <laughs> Here we go. Oh, like got a couple of little bumps. It's gotta be tight enough, right? That's gotta be tight. That Loctite dries. Okay. Just gonna jack it up. Yeah, put your spacer in first. Oh. That's the whole point of doing this. Spacer. There we go. Locked, Locked right, right in. in. Nice. Now we have to shoe jack it up. All right, front's almost done. Gotta put on our top. Can you see me? I can see Gotta you. put on the top nut up here. Brian's gonna do whatever he's doing down here. I don't know what that is. Probably nothing. <laughs> I'm here We're turning things around around here, haven't we? I'm here for moral support. <laughs> I guess all those months of me doing nothing, <laughs> clowning around. <laughs> One side done. Same thing on the other side. Then we go to the back. We never use directions anyway. <laughs> all right, for my calculations, this goes under the spring. Sounds sufficient. This drops down the little arm here. Okay. And this holds a shock in. Simple enough. Can't be, can't go wrong with that. It's good. So we have the shock brackets here to extend the shocks up in the back. Could not figure out how they went. I went over and had a talk with Rob's dog. He explained everything since he was the only one to see the instructions. As you can see, we didn't make it before daylight. The last piece of the puzzle is the spacer. This massive spring. And this massive spring. <laughs> you can crush that thing. You're gonna bend it. Um, if you are the other guy who's lifting their smart car, make sure <laughs> <laughs> Make sure your arrow here is pointing towards the front. It's got a little bit of a, an angle. That way she fits all up there nice and perfect. If you got it upside down. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Thank you.
going to be huge. Well, the drive over the ball flag in sight. <laughs> All right, we got her all lifted up. It's a fine Volkswagen. It's it's awesome. Come on. <laughs> it's the Volks coolest thing ever. <laughs> Volkswagen or not. No. Yeah, now we're going to be able to put the camera gear in the back. We got AC because we're in Florida. Yep. We can drive it to town, whatever. It's going to be a lot of fun. Right. Just needs a roof rack and a spiral staircase. And I like how you think. <laughs> there you go. All right. Thanks for watching. <laughs>